Hey everybody, today I'm going to show you how to play a fast drum fill using 32nd and 16th notes. Now this drum fill uses a right left right left rudiment, alright? So that is how you will be striking the drums, right left right left, okay? Now the first two notes will be 16, will be 32nd notes, I'm sorry, and the second two notes will be 16th notes. And it will sound something like this. I'm going to play it really slowly at first, all right? Now, as you can see, I struck the first, the my, my first rack tom uh, with the first two hits, and then my snare drum with the second two hits. And that is what I feel produces the best the best sound for this drum fill is bringing the fill into you. So you're going to do tom, tom, snare, snare. You might do your second rack tom, 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 snare, snare. Then you might do your bass tom, your floor tom over here, tom, tom, snare, snare. All right? So as long as you bring the beat into you, bring the fill into you, it will sound good. And when you play it in the middle of a beat, you're going to exit out of the drum fill however you like. That, that drum fill is only meant to sort of begin the fill and then you can exit, you know. That was not the greatest exit, but however you like. I'm gonna play a few examples for you right now. So I'm gonna incorporate that drum fill that I just showed you, two 32nd notes, right, left, and then two 16th notes, right, left, into a beat, and then I'm gonna exit out of the drum fill using, you know, a random variation of toms or cymbals, all right? So listen closely. drum fill. It is just two 32nd notes followed by two 16th notes in a right left right left pattern. Try to bring the drum fill into you by going from the toms to, the, to your snare and then try and exit out of the drum fill with a random variation of tom hits or cymbal hits. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.